Local business news, events, and awards. We'll hear all about this from the Evansville Regional Economic Partnership. Dominic Pogge is the regional director of the Southwest Indiana SBDC. Good morning. Good morning, Angie. Well, there's a whole list of exciting things to talk about, and let's just kick it off with the Veteran-Owned Business Award. Yeah, there certainly is. Thanks for having me on. Um, we were really excited to announce that Mid-America Safety Solutions, a Southwest Indiana business, was recently awarded uh, the Veteran-Owned Business of the Year Award by the state. Um, this was a fantastic recognition uh, because they started off from uh, just an idea in 2017. Um, uh, Jeff Klump had uh, realized that there wasn't a local company to provide traffic safety for um, uh, linemen when they would go to repair power lines. And uh, in talking with Duke Energy about the need, um, he realized that, hey, you know, I can apply my experience from the Marine Corps and, and my degree from IU and my experience with Duke. Um, I can combine all of that into um, a new company. And uh, today they boast over 100 employees and they've got operations going in multiple states. Um, so we just couldn't be more proud of the achievement that they've uh, been able to, to make in, these, in this short amount of time. Well, that's what I was just thinking. That is a short period of time to get that much recognition. So I know you're very happy about that. And you just had the first uh, regional economic partnership meeting. How did that go? Yeah, so that was our annual meeting and dinner. That was the inaugural event. And uh, it's really in celebration of the merger that's come together uh, between the Southwest Indiana Chamber, the Economic Development Coalition of Southwest Indiana, and the Growth Alliance for Greater Evansville. Um, those three organizations came together as of April 1st of this year. Um, and really, in short, it's to help businesses understand that, hey, there's now just one door to knock on when you want to find resources or um, explore doing business or expanding your business in Southwest Indiana. Um, so this annual meeting and dinner went uh, extremely well. We held it at the Ford Center here in downtown Evansville, and uh, we were able to recognize three businesses um, right out the gate for their just contributions to the community. And, um, you know, we're just really excited to get out and, and see some folks in person again, um, given oh, yeah. that we really haven't had those opportunities. <laughs> yeah, that, that's big for all of us these days. And I'm sure people can go to your website and see who the winners were for those other awards. Yeah, absolutely. So those winners, just in short, our um, community champion was uh, Nix Companies. Uh, distinguished Business is uh, United Companies. And Business of the Year was Toyota Manufacturing Indiana. All right, tell us about the Newcomer's Guide. Yeah, so that's, um, you know, you'll see a lot going on here at, uh, at ERAP if you look closely. Um, even though these organizations merged on April 1, they have really just come together and uh, been incredibly productive since then. Um, and one of those things is the Newcomer's Guide. Um, so one of the, the overall um, uh, things that we're after here at ERAP is making the, the region a more attractive place to, to work and live. And we feel like a newcomer's guide is a great way to um, help folks understand that there's a lot to offer here in Southwest Indiana uh, in terms of culture, you know, things to do, uh, places to live. And it's a great way to uh, sell our region to, to folks who don't know much about it, um, or even to folks like myself who moved here a few years ago and uh, may not know about all the things going on yet that they could participate in. Well, there's so many other things to talk about, and we'll send everybody to your website. Thank you, Dominic, for being with us. Thanks for having me. Have a good day. You too.